Welcome, welcome, welcome. Well, they play sisters on the hit Hallmark series, Chesapeake Shores, and we're welcoming them to our home. Megan Ori, Lacey Maley, it's good to have you guys here. I know things heat up. I mean, you know, Jesse Metcalf's char character and yours really getting close, and you know that you've really become something. You've crossed a threshold of yeah. sorts. Finally. When you Finally. get, when you achieve a hashtag, <laughs> right? Oh, like, yeah. you guys are a hashtag now. We right? are a hashtag, yeah. Yeah, yeah. what is the hashtag? <laughs> uh, hashtag Trabby. Trabby, I like Trabby. it. Trabby. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Trabby. I think if you guys have a baby, you should name it Trabby. I think so too. Or Travis. Yeah, or, tra or Travis. Yeah, there, it's a look boy. At, look at all of look. the, everything that's going out on a social media now with oh, all wow. the hashtags and and what have you be. That's I mean, really funny. This, I'm, I'm obsessed with the show. I think our viewers know this. It's because I'm from the Chesapeake Bay area, Chesapeake Shores. Yeah. Finally, you kissed. Yeah. Yes. I mean, finally. I, well, I was like, come on, when is this going to happen? And it finally happened in the last episode. Yeah, well, it's going to happen a little bit more. Oh, it is? Yeah. yeah. Look, yeah. look. Yeah. I know, look at that. There's, it's fantastic. There's See, that deserves a few more that. that. That's coming up on Sunday. <laughs> that deserves a hashtag. It does. We tried and it didn't work. It was either yeah. Mebby or Dark. And it just didn't work. It didn't, just wasn't. Not, not neither happening. one of them catches. I yeah. don't know what that's about. Yeah. <laughs> but you definitely are going to have more of the, that kissing in, in the season finale. I yeah, understand. they really kind of took all of the waiting from the whole season and just piled it all, all into the last episode. So there's a lot of kissing. A lot of chapstick? A lot of chapstick. Yeah, well, how does yeah. that work? I mean, do you every lips, time... Touch another person's lips no, and that's... Well, I know that. <laughs> but no, like when you do the take, because you get lipstick transferred, and like you get one take and then you gotta go, okay, redo, reapply. Well, yeah, no, there's, it's, it's not the most romantic of uh, situations because you're surrounded by camera people and crew yeah. and everybody's, you know, and there's people holding umbrellas because it was raining and, and uh, yeah, you don't want your lipstick to come off on your, your kissing partner's mouth. Right. Yeah. And so you have to wear a lip stain, we like oh, to call it. A okay. lip stain. It's a lip stain, which I don't know if you've worn them, but yeah. it makes your lips quite dry. Mm -hmm. So between every take, you're like applying chapstick so your <laughs> lips don't chafe off. And, yeah. and Does it stain it? Not permanently. Obviously. It stains my lips, but not his lips. Yeah, but I mean, when you put on, does it ever come off? It's staining your I mean, lips. No, yeah, yeah, like there's the no stain day. there. You could, yeah. 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 It's not like paint. It's not, <laughs> it's not like paint. paint it's or tattoo. It's just really it's heavy, heavily paint. chemical, probably. Yeah, I know. Isn't that the truth? I guess you could use probably cherries or something. It would do the same trick. That is a good idea. So there are lots of surprises, Mark. I don't know if yeah. you know, but there are lots of surprises. Well, and kissing. And kisses. And, kissing. Yeah. and even more surprises that are unfolding here in the season finale. Things are kind of getting contentious between you guys and your other sister, Brie. Mm-hmm. Yes. And we have a clip of you spying on Brie, unbeknownst to her or her surprise visitor. Let's take a look. Surprise visitor. Hey, who's that over at Brie's? Do you use those a lot? Ew, no. Oh, <gasps> that's Martin. Deming? Who's Martin Deming? Bree's ex-boyfriend. <sighs> Does Bree know that he's coming? No, he wanted to surprise her. <sighs> what happened between them? Martin cheated. Shouldn't you be cooking? Bree should be sending him packing. Mm -hmm. You'd have to unpack first. What does that mean? Martin left his bag by the front door. Well, unless that's Lee's. Lee is staying here. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Mm -hmm. Lee is staying here. Oh, uh -huh. uh -huh. you know what? You know what? It's fine. I get my girls. I can handle anything. Okay, good. Because you may want to hold that thought. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> The plot oh, thickens. <laughs> All right, I, I want to get back into this friendship thing because you know when you have friends, you lean on them. Mm -hmm. There's a song there, by the way. Lean yeah, on I think it, it could be a big hit. I think. I understand. So, <laughs> so you actually you have a dog, right? Amelia. I know Amelia, Amelia has, Amelia has, a, dog. has yeah. a dog. But who is dog sitting here? Me. I am staying in Amelia's house right now. Dog sitting Wilson. Oh. 
So we're having a great time. So now I see how this is working. You get to know each other. You're going to help her move. Yes. Yeah. And then help paint, and then the dog sitting thing yeah. happens. Yeah. And, more and Amelia's house is like gorgeous, stunning. So we're we're having a great. And time. so and then <laughs> do you go outside of the food chain. Like, do you feed the dog whatever you want, or while you're house sitting, or you're strict? No, because she might watch this. Okay. Uh, I have I just been, to make a little sure bit because been following the doggy diet. Just like here. We'll you got to be a good step parent to Here's the dog. You know. That's true. Yeah. It's true. So All right. So we talked a little bit about you eloping to Vegas. After you asked right. for the latte yeah. and ring, yeah, totally. So, <laughs> whose idea was that? Well, it was, Did, was that your idea? <laughs> <laughs> Probably it so. Like it was I really yeah. yeah. she, she just approved the process at the end. It was actually end, Amelia yeah. and I on the flight down to LA. Uh, I was looking at the flight map on the the chair in the plane yeah. and I noticed Vegas and I'm like man I hate Vegas I'm so over it like I don't get it but for some reason it keeps popping into my head the last few months I'm like the Vegas sign I don't want to go there what is that and then one thing led to another and I was like ah, here's what I think oh look at the picture yeah. oh yeah that's oh, right after oh. we did it <laughs> What? I was like, oops, I got married. And the best thing, too, is we were talking about it yeah. the night before, and we were all supposed to go for dinner, Amelia oh, yeah, and right. my husband and everybody. And we got a text from them in the morning at like they can't 8 or 9 o'clock. Yeah, it's like, I don't think we're going to make it for dinner because I think we're actually just going to go to Vegas today. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty awesome. Really? And was it at all romantic? It like, was totally was... romantic. It was. It was and... totally, but it didn't mean to be. I thought, I'm like, let's just do tacky. Like, I'm going to wear cutoffs. Like, it's just going to be like <laughs> but so Are there tacky. good photos or anything? Well, I mean, yeah, I'm... the there best photo. The, well, the, the you in front of the Vegas. Oh yeah, that was actually really pretty awesome. Yeah, I love Who that. Who married photo. you? Like Elvis? Her name was. <laughs> oh, I just wanted... Okay, no, Elvis was closed. Oh, oh so bad. I wanted get... Elvis to marry us. Seriously. But a woman named Cher with a blonde crooked wig. Hot. And like she it. had a really thick <laughs> accent and she smoked her voice and she was like not into it. It was hot. She was like, I just want to watch CSI. Like, what package do you want? Like, just like get out of here. And we're like so giddy and excited. And she was just like not happy. It. It was, that's yeah, awesome. It was awesome. Like, yeah. she, that's her job. I'm yeah, just not into this miserable. right now. Yeah. Okay. Pick a package up there. Yeah. This all happened so quick. Yep. You did it, whatever. Afterwards, did you go, oh my gosh, we just got married in Vegas? Yeah. You did? Yeah. yeah. Oh well, boy. Not, yeah, but like, yes, we just got married in Vegas. What about your family? What did they say? They were pretty happy. They, they, were, like, yeah. they, were, they were shocked, but not surprised. Because I tend to do impulsive things. So now that you're married <laughs> and married, When's family? Are you thinking about family? Are children popping into the picture at all? Into the conversation at all? Yeah, Do you really? go to the park and you go, oh, look at those little cute kids? <laughs> no. no, not at all. Not so Megan, I'm, I'm, my husband and I were, we've been talking about it, but I'm kind of terrified of children. So, but you have two children in the show. I know, and they two. make me even more terrified. <laughs> <laughs> it's practice. It's built-in practice. It's perfect. For I know, you. but I just got them at seven and nine, so it's like I missed all the build-up stage, and I just got like adult, little mini adults. Little people. Oh, like, yeah. You like them at that age? Yeah. Oh, they're they're. I love them. They're so fun, but they're so exhausting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't I can write the book. Oh, oh, but look how cute. Look they're how like, cute. Oh, they're the best girls. I love them so much. So is that why you're frightened of them? Because they have a lot of energy. Yeah, I yeah. just I like to have my coffee and like read the paper in the morning and you can you can bribe kids by the way they don't yeah, see it coming. This is what they I've do. learned. That yeah, you can. So oh, I, you, no, wow. I, I'm, yeah, I'm not even joking. I have learned from Abby and Caden uh -huh. that the way that you deal with children is you just bribe them a little bit. That's that's right. that's what, how you, how do you do bribe them. Toys or do you do with what? No, no, no. So the girls both like food. They're both good foodies. Oh, good foodies. So on the pilot, we were doing a scene where you were there. For oh yeah, us. yeah, yeah. So we were doing a scene at the dinner table, and they're little kids, and they get tired, and they've yeah. been there all day, yeah. and you know, God bless them. They're just they're doing so well, and. Abby, who's the little one, she was really tired and we had lima beans for dinner in the you salad and she loves lima beans. Lima beans? Lima beans are her favorite thing <laughs> on the planet. It's so weird. And so basically what I did is I took all the little lima beans out of the salad and I said, okay, every time you get through a take, you get lima beans. And she was so excited. She was so happy. Who are these children? She was like, she, she, we who's... finished the scene and she was like, I don't want to go. I want more lima beans. <laughs> wow. She was so I would funny. think M&M's, not lima beans. I know, right? No, well, I'm, I you guys are, are big social media fans. You do a lot of social media stuff. You're on Twitter, constantly live tweeting. Live tweeting, yep. You guys are Instagramming all the time. Who do you think takes the most selfies on set? Barbara, Barbara Niven. Niven. Really? Oh, yeah. Barbara? I've been hearing she this about her. She is like her. the queen of uh, yeah. She is yeah. constantly yes. taking pictures. Yeah. In fact, she we 
didn't even ask her and she sent some to us. <laughs> oh, yeah. She's, yeah. She was like, here, take these. Oh, Here's God, some yeah. more. Have some more.